Hey gang, welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for being here. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Chris. I love candles, fragrance, home decor, and much more. And we will be talking about some fragrances today. And that is going to be the new fragrance from Bath & Body Works, the Sweetheart Cherry. So I have been looking for this for it seems like for weeks now. So BBW Addict underscore Shay on Instagram and everyone else has been talking about this sweetheart cherry. And ever since she said that it was going to be put out in the stores, uh, let me look up the message here. Let me see when she sent that message because ever since then I was like, boo, I could like, that's all I could think about. So December 29th, she messaged me saying that their store was putting it out that night. So I was like, oh, yes, I'm excited to go out and find it myself. So guess what day we found it on? So she messaged me on December 9th. I didn't find it until January 7th. So that was literally like 10 days of going out hunting for this sweetheart cherry. And we finally found it. So we picked up the fine fragrance mist here. We picked up, woo, I'm so excited. We picked up the body cream. And then we also picked up the shower gel. So I did have two rewards. So I used my rewards on the Fine Fragrance Mist and the body cream. And then we bought the shower gel for $14.95. Since it was the cheaper product, I went ahead and bought the shower gel. Saved myself a little bit of money there. So I just, I could not have, like, not have the whole set. I had to have the shower gel with the fine fragrance mist and the body cream. So first impression here, let's go ahead and smell it in the cap first. So Sweetheart Cherry. Love, love, love the packaging. I love the cherry. It looks metallic. We got some silver, some pink. Super, super cool looking. So yes, this whole collection is reward eligible. So we have $16.95 on the Fine Fragrance Mist, $16.95 on the body cream. And then the shower gel or the body wash is $14.95. So it has scent notes of wild cherry, crushed pistachio, and whipped vanilla. I'm excited. All right, here we go. This is the first time I smelled it. I don't I don't know how I've like stopped myself from smelling this for the past 4 days. Oh, this is good. I'm definitely getting like sweetness. I can definitely smell the cherry. Yeah, is that whipped cream? Whipped vanilla. That whipped vanilla, yeah. Wow, this is so good. Let's go ahead and spray it on the arm here. Oh, I can smell the pistachio when it's on my arm. Oh, I think I'm in love. Oh, yeah. Sweetheart Cherry, I'm in love. So on the back here, it says, bring out your inner sweetness with a scent of juicy cherries and savory pistachios. Life's dreamier with a sweet treat. Oh, I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Okay, so now we have the body cream. So the body cream has the same scent notes here. This is Ultimate Hydration Body Cream. It's supposed to be 24-hour moisture. It has vitamin E, aloe, shea and cocoa butter, and hyaluronic acid. I do prefer the body cream over the body lotions, but the body creams do tend to go fast. They tend to go fast. They tend to go bad faster. But I don't think I'm going to have a single problem getting this like done within the next month, probably in February. So I think I'm going to throw this in Project Use It Up because I just want to experience it. It's new, something I haven't had before. So Sweetheart Cherry, let's go ahead and try the body cream. Okay, we got a hint of yellow, just a little tint of it. So the body, uh, body cream here... Super, super adorable. We have that same kind of like burgundy red, the cherries. It's kind of like a cherry color. And we have that pink background with like some little black banners. Super, super like Valentine's Day y, very like sweet hearty. You could definitely pick this up for um like your sweetheart for Valentine's Day. I think they're gonna love you, especially if they're into like foodie gourmand fragrances. Oh, pistachio. Oh my god, the pistachio is so strong in this fragrance. 
And the cherry, I didn't think I was going to like like a cherry, nutty, creamy type of fragrance. But that's what I'm getting and I'm loving it. Yes, I'm liking the body cream. Okay, we're two for two. Let's go ahead and try out the shower gel. Let's go ahead and smell it here. The shower gel, the packaging is it's kind of meh. I feel like they could have done a little better on the shower gel or the body wash. I kind of wish it just like matched the collection here with like the pink uh, background with like some cherries. Like you can barely, almost barely see the cherries on this one. So the packaging could have been a little better, but let's go ahead and smell it here. Oh yeah, that's good. I'm definitely getting that cherry. It's like a like a super like tarty cherry. What's the scent in that? Wild cherry. Yeah, it's like a wild cherry, yeah. Oh, this is like kind of fruity, kind of tarty. Kind of nutty. I'm getting that nuttiness. Yes, this is like a cherry nutty shower gel body wash. I'm loving it. All right, let me go ahead and hop in the shower. Let's go ahead and try it out here, and then I'll be right back for the review. Woo! All right, we are out of the shower. We are in our Valentine's Day pajamas in honor of the Sweetheart Cherry Fragrance. All right, so I got my notes wrote down. We got a lot of notes wrote down here. So let's go ahead and start off with the shower gel here. So the shower gel, I wrote down that it was very cherry forward at the beginning and then it kind of went into like this whipped vanilla-y kind of fragrance and then it transferred over to like a pistachio like nutty fragrance. Yeah, definitely getting that like whipped vanilla when I was in the shower. It has like kind of like this like, I don't want to say like souriness, but it almost gave me that kind of vibe. Uh, so I wrote down wild and tardy. Very fluffy. I think that's that whipped vanilla. And then I got a nutty fragrance. So I did love the actual shower gel though. Let's see if I can show you here. So the shower gel itself is very like purpley. And I absolutely loved that about it. It's kind of like this like wild, like red cherry, like purpley kind of gel. So I absolutely loved that about it. I love the like colored shower gels. They really make the experience a little bit better in my, uh, um, in my opinion. And then I did wrote down it lathered up pretty good. So that's always good when the body washes lather up, makes a lot of bubbles. Uh, and then I put down a firecracker pop vibe. So we're gonna get into that towards the end of the video here, but yeah, this is giving me like firecracker pop vibes, not like a repackage or anything like that, but very, very similar kind of. So that is the shower gel. I definitely loved it. Yeah, very, very good. I would say it's my, it's like a tie between the first product that I love the most, like the number one product. So it's definitely like number one, number two. It's a tie between the fine fragrance mist here. So obviously the body cream, we have landed into third place for the body cream out of all of the products here. So I will say one thing about this body cream is that it is like very, very thick. It almost felt like like body butter almost on me. Like very, very thick formula. Very cherry. I loved how fruity it was. I loved how like thick it was. It absorbed into my skin very well. And it's almost like it has a mixture of like half cherry, half pistachio with like that whipped vanilla covered all over both of them. Yeah, definitely like a good cherry pistachio with like some vanilla mixed in between both of them. That's exactly what I got from the body cream here. I will say though, the body cream was my least favorite. I'm not a huge fan of the dry down here. The dry down gives me very like musky vibes. I don't know. So let's go ahead and talk about the fine fragrance mist here. So as you can tell, I did use a good amount here. So the fine fragrance mist was very cherry on top of the body cream. It added like this cherryness to it. Almost like a extra cherryness on top of the body cream. But it also turns very nutty. That pistachio, I really get that pistachio on my skin. 
I'll say on my clothes up here, I'm really getting a lot of that cherry, but the second it hits my body chemistry, that pistachio nuttiness fragrance really comes out strong. And I feel like it could be long lasting. So I'm going to go ahead and wear it again tomorrow. We're going to wear it to work. See if we get some compliments. See how long it lasts. See if I have to reapply it at all. So this uh, fragrance, this collection here, on the back of the fine fragrance mist, it says, bring out your inner sweetness with the sense of juicy cherries and savory pistachios. So that's what I'm getting. I think that's kind of like what I'm not liking about it. It's like this sweet and like savory mixed together. So I have sweet and savory mixed together on the dry down. Very, very musky in my opinion. It has like this kind of like sour, tarty, like muskiness. Yeah, borderline not really liking the dry down here. I love this fragrance on the opening spray, the opening usage, but I will say on the dry down, I'm definitely not much of a fan of it as I was when I first tried it out. It's still a good scent though. I think it's an awesome kind of like fruity, nutty, like they said, it's like a sweet and a savory scent mixed together. Um, so this is what it gave me. So after I started using it, it went from a love down to like a like. So I'm not in love with it anymore, but it did give me like firecracker pop vibes. I'm not going to lie. I sprayed both of these here in like the little cap. Yeah, very firecracker pop vibes here. Very cherry, fruity. I will say one thing though, it is like a, it's a firecracker pop minus the cherry added the pistachio nuttiness. That's kind of what I got from it. And I will say the name, the name could be like a little misleading. So when you think of sweetheart cherry, I'm thinking of like maybe it's kind of like a candy cherry scent, like a sweet candy cherry scent. And it's really not that at all. I know some people were saying, because I didn't watch a whole lot of reviews, I just heard some things here and there that people were saying it's kind of like a gourmand kind of uh, fragrance. And I'm not really getting gourmand from it. It's not really gourmand. It's not bakery. It's just very sweet and nutty and creamy. Yeah, so I think they could have possibly renamed this and my kind of like suggestion here would have been Pistachio and Cherry Hearts. I feel like that would have been like a better name for it on in my opinion the, with the, the fragrance and on my body chemistry. That is kind of like the name I came up with. So yeah, it could smell good though to other people. So we're going to go ahead and try it out again tomorrow. I'm going to go ahead and layer it up. We're going to go to work. We're going to see if we get any compliments, if anyone says anything. So yeah, I'm excited to go ahead and try this out tomorrow. I will go ahead and give you guys a little feedback after that and see what happens. But let me know, have you gotten your hands on the Sweetheart Cherry fragrance yet? I definitely want to see what other people think about this. So I can finally watch the other reviews now to kind of see what other people are saying. So that is my review on the new Sweetheart Cherry fragrance from Bath & Body Works. Check it out. It is the new Valentine's Day fragrance for 2024. I know some stores don't have them yet, but keep checking. They could pop up any day now. So yes, I was very, very excited to see the display. The display was absolutely beautiful. I'm going to throw up a picture here. I just think it looked, it really caught my eye. The, the strawberry pound cake with that sweetheart cherry, it just mixed so well. It looks so beautiful. I thought it looked so pretty, very red and pink. And yeah, it definitely the second I seen it, I was like, oh yeah, let me go over there. Let me see what's happening. There's some new pink and red stuff. I know that's got to be for Valentine's Day. So yeah, super excited to finally try out a new scent. The first new scent for 2024. And you guys, I'm going to have like a really, really fun video at the end of the year. So it's going to be a 12 month process, but we are going to pick up every single fine fragrance mist here and we're going to rank them at the end of the year. It's going to be the biggest ranking video I've ever seen on YouTube. So I'm excited. Let's see how many fragrances they come out with this year. I'm really, I can't wait to see what they do this year. And we're going to get more of these like, fruity scents? Are we going to get some bakery scents? Are we going to get a bake shop collection? I definitely love my 
Bakery Gourmand, a fine fragrance mist and body care. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know what you think about Sweetheart Cherry if you have it. And if you don't have it yet, let me know what you think about it when you get it. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.